welcome back guys to another video of visions of mana so uh just came from uh the safe point no need for you guys to to see me coming from there uh from there to here so let us continue from where we left in the last episode uh, what was it again i was Talofos's enemy right or was it his ally? No. Oh. He looks really torn up about forgetting his part. Get out the lantern already! My! What a bewitching gleam you have there! It touches me deep within my soul. The light will help you. Just keep looking at it, okay? That's it. Watch the lantern. Eureka! I've got it! I finally remember some of what happens in Delafos and Cerulea. It's all back? You're sure? You would doubt a professional such as myself? Here's a rendition of my part from the beginning of the play. Delafos and Cerulea, Act One. Enter General Delafos, fresh from the battlefield, worn down but still going strong. The warring factions had begun cutting down innocent farmers and their families. Delafo spots our heroine Cerulea as she attempts unsuccessfully to flee. Now, the general was a soldier the likes of which had never been seen before or since. But even a man of his caliber was unable to stop the onslaught. Suddenly, an arrow is loosed at the fair maiden. Delafo takes the arrow in her stead, leaving his right arm damaged and immobile. The two manage to escape the battlefield and leave their past behind them. They are the only survivors of that bloody skirmish. So Delafos saved Cerulea at the cost of his arm. I guess he couldn't fight anymore after that. Huzzah! <laughs> I should head backstage and let the troop leader know that I'm ready for my close-up. Thanks for saving my acting career! Alrighty, one, he sacrificed one done, two left. For her. That takes courage. Did I enter from stage right? Or left? Oh dear, this won't do at all! Are you part of the acting troupe? Why are you carrying around a lantern like that? What are you supposed to be? The ghost of Alms and Solgard's past? I'll leave the role-playing to the professionals. But you should take a good look either way. Well, I'll be. It's like the haze has cleared from my mind. You have all illuminated my way in the dark. Why, you're not just saying that, right? How can you be sure? A fine thing to say! How about I spoil the middle of the play for you? Then will you believe me? Delafos and Cerulea, Act Two. Delafos gains mastery of the Mana Sword. Delafos and Cerulea begin a peaceful life together, away from the devastations of war. Until one day, an emissary of the Mana Goddess comes to Delafos, begging for his help to save the world from chaos. This fairy tells him of great Benevadon monsters brought about by the Mortals' War. Only one strong enough of both heart and body stands a chance against the fiends. Delafos accepts the mission and receives the Sword of Mana. Miraculously, his injured arm is healed and his former strength restored. Okay. Delafos takes the Mana Sword and goes off to slay the Benevidons. Got it. Why am I still here prattling on to you? I have to find the troop leader and let her know I'm ready. Thanks, I guess. Bye. Accepting the goddess's request and her sword. He really was a hero back then. Oh, well, last one. The goddess's heroic... No. The goddess's own... Not that either. What is the line? 
Mister, you look like you need some help. Who goes there? Uh, nobody. Just some theater enthusiast. In fact, the troop leader asked us to ask you to look at this lantern. The goddess is hero champion! Slayer of all eight but never dons! Oh, that's it! What a load off my mind. Well, well, lucky you. Think you're up to performing the part? Well, I should rehearse once first before I go back. And stay and listen. <clears throat> Delafos and Cerulea. Act three. Delafos's epic journey. At the behest of the mana goddess, Delafos traveled the world, sword in hand, subduing each and every Benevadon as it appeared in his path. The road was tough, but Delafos persevered. He single-handedly defeated all eight mighty monsters, earning him a hero's welcome from the people he saved. Delafos was unstoppable for one reason and one alone. A promise made on Entwine Bridge Pass to his beloved Cerulea. Someday, I swear I will return to you. Until that day, I swear I will wait for you. He traveled the whole world subduing Benevidons alone? We've had a hard enough time in a group. I'm saved. <laughs> they can't recast me now, but I better practice some more before curtain call. You have my gratitude. All right, that's Pretty done. What's next? Lantern works so fast. There is a bright future for this fellowship of actors yet. Now that we've gotten the hang of it, Let's use the lantern on the troop leader one more time. Agreed. Back into the theater we go. We gotta get the troop leader to remember her part. She should be on stage. Time to bust out the Lumina lantern one more time. If it isn't the arms. Thank you for assisting our actors with their warm-ups. Is everyone accounted for? Well, there is one minor hiccup. Our troop leader is nowhere to be found. Can you help us search for her? Oh, this is terrible! Horrifying! What? Did something happen to our leader? No, not her! Look at the sky! What is to become of us all? Huh? <laughs> oh, no! What's going on? I've got a bad feeling about this. Take cover here. We'll check it out. I'll come with you. The show cannot go on without our troop leader. I have to find her. Stick close to us and don't go looking for trouble. No, not the sky. And I just walked two steps. God damn it. Oh, there we go. Wait a second. Aish? What are you doing here? My investigations in Lagrazzo have concluded. I did say that I would meet up with you when I was finished. Did I not? Please note that I do not bring glad tidings, however. I observed a peculiarly dense concentration of mana power flowing toward none other than the Temple of Wendell. The Temple of Wendell, as I'm sure you know, was once a sacred place of pilgrimage in the days of Fadiel. The elemental power of darkness, namely knowledge, and that of light, the thirst for truth, have always been intertwined. Two halves of the same whole, if you will. For those with knowledge are wont to seek the truth. In the distant past, those learned people sought solace in Wendell. Informative lecture, but we have other things to worry about. Namely, if that mana power is what I think it is. Yes. As Julie has undoubtedly inferred, the Benevidon of Light has been released from her seal. Figures, always trust your roots. 
b b benevodon of light? Oh dear, we must find our leader as soon as possible. Dalafos? <sighs> I had not accounted for this. Uh, this gentleman is merely playing the part of the protagonist in Dalafos and Cerulea. But his Cerulea counterpart is nowhere to be found. Hmm. I did notice someone wearing peculiarly theatrical clothing, wandering off in that direction earlier. Oh dear, where could she have been going? We should go after her. For a moment, I mistook that man for Delafos himself. <laughs> a brilliant costume, that. <laughs> yeah. Dear Delafos, my heart is forever with you. I will wait for you always. What did she say? I couldn't make it out. Maybe she's... Man, again? Beloved Delafos, champion of the goddess and hero to the people. Do not bother with me. I am fine. She doesn't seem to know what she's doing. We must keep a weather eye on her whereabouts. Man, tell me I don't have to do a couple of steps and then watch this? that again. That is very annoying. Yes! We already know. She's going up there. Oh my god. Here we go. Dear Dalo, forgive them. Be at peace. Be a beacon of hope, my hero. Damn. This reminds me of when Palomino went off on her own in Tata. How far is our troop leader planning to go? It could be dangerous. All right, I dangerous? see the chest. There it is. Let me see. A rare item. <laughs> Here we go again. way Cerulea you must escape from this battlefield of sorrow I will sacrifice my arm my battalion anything to save you Taylor I will wait for always uh, huh ah, what are you doing you were not in your right mind I only meant to stop you. Why am I here, of all places? You don't remember? There is a chance that your consciousness was corrupted by an outside force. I myself was once overcome in such a way. Your conversation sounded like lines straight from your play. Was it rehearsed? No, it was all ad-libbed. I just said what sounded right. I... I can't even think straight. Oh, my head. Hang on. Let's try the Lumina Lantern. No. Nothing. I can't remember. The glaring light will obscure the boundaries of reality. This is what Lorimar's prophecy of destruction portends. The cause of this amnesia may be linked to the reactivation of the Benevodon of Light. Appropriate if the power of the elemental vessel stays the effects somewhat. Light, like the moon, has power over the mind. If we can defeat the monster, everything should go back to normal. Sounds like our only option is to stop the Benevodon then. I shall leave the subjugation of our foe in your capable hands. Rest assured, I will see these performers back to the theater. How noble. So you don't intend to grill them on this the second they're out of danger? 
My, my, you are smarter than you look. I would be remiss in my duties as a scholar if I didn't document this incident thoroughly. Let Aish do what he needs to. He's got his own priorities. We have to head to the Temple of Wendell. My thoughts are with you, even when we are apart, my friends. Yeah, yeah. Be careful. Oh, gotta get out of the chest. This is kind of exciting. Is this? has been here since the time of Fadiel, right? The decor does have a certain nostalgia to it. Was the world really that different back then? Honestly, Sproutwings and Spirits lived in a whole other realm, so I have no idea what you saps were up to. Never crossed my mind. But now I wonder what people hope to gain by coming to places like this. <laughs> I never cared about that kind of thing in the past. Other people's business was their own. You've grown a lot over this journey, Jule. A change of heart isn't a bad thing. My travels as a hired blade were what really opened my eyes to the world around me. Thanks. I'll try not to let my newfound altruism go to my head. Aha, uh -huh, so you were getting worried. That's not what I said. Like the truth seekers of old, our travels have brought us to this temple. Okay, that's enough self-reflection. We have a Benevidon to defeat. Right! We have a duty to the actors and to the future Alm of Light. Temple of Wendell. Odd that Aish had no interest in observing the Benevidon. I think he was preoccupied with the actors and what happened to them. I see. A stranger phenomenon superseding the interest in the first. All right, all right, this is easy. Just have to use the light. Assist us! To reflect somewhere. Hmm. Aha! The key is reflecting the light so we can move forward. Yeah, pretty easy. Well, you do it. <laughs> sure. Time to get more practice in with the elemental vessel. I have gathered some grizzly, sir. I will take this. When walking on icy ground, your characters will slip and slide. Okay. There is something supreme. Everyone, My gratitude. Now! I'll be more careful next time. Ooh! Got a jackal pelt for our mission. I failed. I wasn't by your side. Huh? Is that voice? C can no one else hear it? Whose lanes are magnificent activated by Lumion Lantern and press X in front of one to travel along it. Mm hmm. Let's check if there's nothing else. No. Mana! To where have we been warped? Okay. I will take this. What's next? Oh, there you are. Mana! I feel the spirit's favor. Hmm, I cannot travel from this one. Yeah. To where have we been warped? There you go. We have another one here. Yeah. I have gathered some grizzly sir. Hmm. 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 Let 
me see something. Hmm. The spirit's strength. Yeah. Hmm. Hmm. It was easier. It was easy, but uh, I wanted to make sure that uh, there was no option this side. Just in case I would miss anything. I should never have gone. I would never have left your side had I known. Wait. There it is again. My gratitude! Moving. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Uh, hmm. So this is open. Let's follow along because I have a feeling that we have to change something in order to open another path. Just my guessing. So let's see. Interact. It is correctly calibrated. Hmm. So there is only two paths. Hmm. 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 It is correctly calibrated. Okay. I don't think I can change you, right? Ah, oh, maybe I can change this one. Yeah. yeah. It is correctly calibrated. So... Come on, game. Don't shoot. Oh, man. Sir. You grabbed the item? Oh, okay. Yeah. Hmm, there's nothing here. Yeah. Thou, is something wrong? Stopping suddenly and looking around at nothing. I'm here if you need someone to talk to. Oh, sorry, no. I'm just trying to be extra careful in here. I'm fine. Nothing else. It is probably. Ah, oh, okay. Oh. Oh, the, this shit looks like a a chest. The spirit strength. To where have we been warped? Yeah. That reminds me. There is one uh, location that we need the the light spirit. Which is the forest. Let's see, anything here? Ooh. Manifest. I feel the spirit's favor. Me too. Talefus had to travel the whole world to defeat the Benevidons. All I eat by him. I can't imagine any Rambo down here. No! Ah! We ask for your assistance. <laughs> 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 This is power. Power. Oh my God. What? That's it? 
There you go. To another area. Woo. Before that, let me check if there is nothing. All right, nothing. Level 29. Did the spirit realm look like this, Julie? Hmm. The spirit realm looked more like Verdius, actually. But there were stone structures like this, too. Brings back to me. <laughs> 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 We have procured a pretty prized possession. More jackal pelts. Nice. Oh shit, I could have activated this. It is correctly calibrated. Mm hmm. Let's see, can I do something about this one? It is correctly calibrated. Hmm. It is correctly calibrated. Hmm. It is correctly calibrated. Ah, uh, that's right. I have high hopes. I have gathered some grizzly sir. Secured. Guide us. It is pulsating with power. Is there a chest here? Nope. Gathered some grizzly sir. Hmm. It is correctly calibrated. Yeah. Wait a minute. There is something in there. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah. Yep, that's a chest. What? I will be your opponent. Stop the distant power. It's far forward. Now, this power. Hmm. 
since I don't need... Mm. Yeah, let's change the... this crystal over here. Yeah. Hmm. It is correctly calibrated. It is correctly calibrated. Uh, nope. Hmm. It is correctly calibrated. It is correctly calibrated. Okay, this will take me here. Oh, what about this crystal? Okay, maybe with that one, yeah, 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 yeah. Maybe I can change the the area of this one. Hmm. It is correctly calibrated. There you go. Now I have all the light bridges to where I want to go. What wondrous where could this be? We gotta get all the, the chests. There is a safe point here, which means a boss. Let us ponder our next plan. Uh, there we go. We always have to fight. I mean, come on. It can't be reasoned with. We gotta fight. We have to stop that spell attack. That seems effective. My gratitude. Keep that. No. My gratitude. Gotcha. That sucks. Me. No. no. Damn, that was a lot of damage. What? Only that? Try What just happened? <laughs> It is faltering from that fatal blow. It is down. Our chance is now. This power. My gratitude.
dead. What an easy boss. Ooh, level 30. Time to call on the elemental spirits. Do all the Trust Gigas Corstone. I doubt it. This whole trip is a little irregular. All right, guys, we beat the boss. Uh, gonna have to wrap it up now. We can be at ease because we already know probably I'm gonna fight another boss. And after that, a lot of dialogue, uh, dialogue uh, between these guys. So we're almost at uh, 40 minutes. So if you enjoyed this episode, leave a like, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Hope you've enjoyed. I'll see you guys on the next episode. Bye.